Well, just hours ago, NASA revealed what they found on the asteroid Bennu. Okay, and this is a connection to Utah here. Oh, yeah. you remember, pieces of this space rock landed in Utah last month. News specialist Kara Bracken is covering the historic moment. I like to call it the Daredevil spacecraft. A journey of a billion miles to asteroid Bennu and back has come to an end. Building, testing, launching. NASA gathering their largest asteroid sample ever with OSIRIS-REx, which brought it back safely to Earth with its first stop, our home state. Landed in Utah, right on the money. It was a picture-perfect mission. It's really uh, a brand new era for us at NASA, and it's the first time that the United States has brought a sample back from Life space. says they've been able to map the entire surface of the new in great detail. Taking their time with processing, NASA says much of their work is done in clean rooms to ensure everything is carefully preserved. Findings released today from the new. So the first analysis shows samples that contain abundant water in the form of hydrated clay minerals, and they contain carbon, and you could see the carbon there. This, what they say, is the biggest carbon-rich asteroid sample ever returned to Earth. The carbon and water mo molecules are exactly the kinds of material that we wanted to find. They are crucial elements in the formation of our own planet. 